Hello friends, welcome back to another video tutorial in Revit architecture. I am architect Sonorai from Gladi Studio and in this today video tutorial I am going to teach you how to create a pattern based curtain wall in Revit. So this is my uh, working mode here and I am working in metric profile. So you can draw any wall here. Suppose this is a wall and it can be of any length and height and if I am going to my 3D view I am going to select this wall and I am going to change this to curtain wall empty and you can see this is our curtain wall. So now uh, for creating a pattern based uh, curtain wall you are required to create a family of it. So I am going to level 0 here and I am going to my file here and I will go to new and then I will go to family here and you can select uh, metric profile here of curtain wall if you are working in imperial you can go to family templates and you can select english imperial so i am working in metric so i am going to english profile here and i am going to select this metric curtain wall panel here and i am going to select this and i am going to click open and now we are in our curtain wall pattern here and i am going to select here interior here and now this is our interior and i'm going to create a profile here so that we can use in our curtain wall so for this i'm going to make some changes here so i'm going to first check on to this and i'm going to make this as uh, 600 mm and now i will select this one and this is 1500 i will also make this as a 600 so this is our profile here and I'm I want to make it a square so I will select 300 here so now this is a square and we are required to create a pattern here so I'm going to create and I will select blend here and I'm going to select a blend and now I'm going to draw any pattern here so I will select this one and now I'm going to edit top here and I will draw any pattern here and can draw in center so I am going to draw a line here and now I will select this circle here and I am going to draw a small circle here and now I am going to delete this line and you can finish this base you can also uh, make changes here 250 so I'm going to make this as a hundred here and now I'm going to edit base also so this is also hundred and now I'm going to finish this so this is our profile of family you can create any material for this here if you want you can create any material you can change the material from here and you can also create parameters here and you can create a family parameter of material so now i'm going to load into a project you can also save as a family and later on you can insert in your design so i'm going to load into project and i'm working in this curtain wall so i'm going to 3d view here and i'm going to select this curtain wall and i'm going to edit type here and i'm going to duplicate this and I'm going to select this function as the interior and now after this uh, vertical grid I'm going to select fixed distance and I'm going to make this a 600 because I have created profile of 600 uh, spacing and layout of horizontal grid also is a fixed distance and I'm going to make this as a 600 and after this I'm going to I uh, select this one curtain panel none and I'm going to uh, use this drop down arrow and you can search for your uh, family profile and this one is uh, the family which I have created family 2 I'm going to select uh, this one family 2 and I'm going to click OK and now this is our profile you can see here this is the profile which I have created and likewise you can create a pattern based curtain wall 
as per your design requirement and you can save your time so i am going to again uh, use wall here and i am going to use this one curtain wall exterior glazing and i am going to draw a pattern of curtain wall here design and i will make this as a curve and now i am going to my 3d view and i will use this one and i am going to use match the properties i will select this one and then i will click onto this and onto this and that's it this is the pattern based curtain wall tutorial so thanks for watching please like share and subscribe my channel bye bye